Hello everyone, welcome and welcome back to my channel. I am Sarah Pedun and today we are up and about in the garden. Joseph is here, he has gotten his greens for, for lunch. <laughs> Let Joseph tell you people something in his language. Uh, the, this is today. Mm. Mm. Today I'm cooking the what? From Uganda, a gove. And zero gov. Like fumba lero, dear lunch, posho, tekemu, heavy nyeva, lunch a verenga, a wed. Okay, so Joseph is saying he's going to cook that with some posho. Posho yeah. is a corn flour or maize flour. So this is what Joseph has been harvesting. So Joseph has just harvested the the flour. We are going to cook. Joseph is going to try it. Joseph and I will try. I've never really eaten it. And Princess told told me an easy way to cook it. I'm going to try and cook it. And we eat. We'll give you a feedback. So Joseph has hung the beans here to dry, not in direct sun, and when the rain comes it's easy to just remove it and keep it. Thank you Joseph.
Guys, you have to be careful holding sugar cane. You see this? It's a bit spiky. So this is the part that Joseph is going to plant. So we're going to put our sugar cane over here. So planting sugarcane is as easy as that. sweet <laughs> let me leave joseph enjoying his sugar cane because they're very good <laughs> These leaves are actually edible, they are for black-eyed peas. You can see that started forming. And the chickens also love them. The chickens and the rabbits do love it. These chickens, these birds are like they didn't test anything. Hey guys. So this is the sugar cane remaining. So last time I had only one passion fruit. I had one passion fruit, it matured and fell and I enjoyed it. So this time we're going to have quite a number. I don't know if I can show you. We have some here for me. The others that side, you can't see it well. I can't show you. I'm so excited for my passion fruit. Also on that tree, that is the tree that gave me one passion fruit the other time. And I can see some flowers forming there. I can't wait for this tree to be covered up. Oh, here, here is a close one. So I can't wait for this tree to be covered up by passion fruit. This is my 
This is angel trumpet. I keep trimming it down. And this is the passion fruit over here. The chickens have pecked all the soil out of it, so we're protecting it by putting this. You can see if I find like this. I just I direct it where I want it to go. Simple. We swept here, but it does not look swept at all. Always put the leaves here so the chickens can make them rot faster. Poop on them, pack it, and then we take it out and put in the garden. So I have some seeds here. I have bell pepper seeds. These are from store-bought bell pepper. And this is some kind of squash that uh, someone brought for me from the village. This is a uh, baby melon, baby melon. And this is almonds. I've, I've tried to put some in the fridge in tissue. I want to see how what, what happens. And this I'm going to put directly on the ground. So yeah, let's let's do this. It rained a lot yesterday. So it's a good day to plant. I already have a lot going on here but I like to hide my my seeds somewhere there I'm going to randomly plant this and then I will transplant them after I will transplant them later on I see I have some space here bell pepper So you can see in this space I have tomatoes, skuma wiki, okra, a tree tomato, Chinese cabbage, but they have enough space. So I'm planting the pepper in between here. When it grows, I may leave one and transplant the rest of the seedlings. That is how I manage in this small space. So I have my string beans here. I've really been keeping them for seed. I have seen something mulching on them. But this one will dry. So something has been eating them. This is almost dry. I'm going to take it out. You can see. So I'm going to take this out. And this. like a green snake this will be enough seedlings seeds for the next season guys I'm so tired of this slug just look at the damage they're doing So I try to hang them. I try to really hang them here so they don't touch the ground. 
but I can't do that to all of them. So now I'm going to hang my beans somewhere to dry. And these are my seeds for next season. As I start to enjoy my fresh beans. So guys, see Joseph and his roses. <laughs> this is sorghum. Oh, no, 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 don't come for it yet. I have some carrots here that I'm going to get. We've had them one by one and they're done now. Oh, what happened to this one? These are quite old, so the rabbits will enjoy them. Let's go and clean them. That is it for today. Thank you so much for watching. If you like my kind of content and you have not yet subscribed, kindly consider subscribing. And if you enjoyed this video, do not forget to give it a thumbs up. I'll see you in the next one.